Hello everyone. Uh, we have studied now meiosis, mitosis, the differences between meiosis and mitosis, and we can now differentiate between them. Uh, now, uh, why it's very important, uh, why myto meiosis is very important. What's going to happen if there is any problem during the cell division happen? Actually, it will cause some, uh, what uh, genetic uh, diseases. Uh, all of us, we heard about the Down syndrome. Maybe we know people, they have Down syndrome. Uh, what is the problem with these uh, people? What happened with them? Why they have this disease? Actually, this disease is a genetic disease. How that a disease occurred it's not uh, formed by a virus it's not formed by a bacteria it's not uh, uh, here actually it's a genetic disease what is that disease how this disease it happened uh, let's uh, look or understand this one about the down syndrome uh, actually for down syndrome it's uh, as we said it's a genetic disease how it's formed you know that we said in meiosis the chromatid meiosis too the chromatids should be what should be separated the chromatid let's go back to this one here to this figure uh, the chromatid i said in meiosis too okay they should be separated okay but what happened in down syndrome the chromatid is not separated and if for some reason, maybe uh, genetically problems, some mutation happen, uh, maybe they are exposed to, to some uh, rays, uh, this will cause the problem with the division. So uh, the chromatid is not separated. Which chromatid actually? During meiosis, the chromatid of a chromosome 21, yani, uh, each one, uh, each pair of chromosome is responsible for something. But if the problem happened with the pair 21, if you remember, we said for this karyotype, these, uh, uh, the chromosomes are found in what? In pairs, right? But if the problem with this pair here the chromatid one of them is not separated that means they are one two three one extra chromosome this one extra chromosome it will cause syndrome disease and can you imagine one extra chromosome that causes this disease okay so and, and you have to know it's one which pair on pair 21 the chromatid is not separated so if the sperm cell has this problem yani it's not uh, separated or the egg cell when it's combined with the sperm or egg cell a healthy one they will give extra a chromosome so the number of chromosomes will not uh, sorry will not be 46 it will be what it will be 47 chromosome can you imagine this one chromosome? It will cause this disease. Yani, you know, it's not easy disease, but uh, for this one, uh, it's caused in a group what, uh, here on the chromosome 21. And instead of two, you have like here uh, three copies of a chromosome 21. Okay? Then, for Down syndrome, actually, these people, Down syndrome, cause a number of health problems and uh, some learning difficulties. They have a lot of problems, actually. Uh, but uh, many people with Down syndrome have fulfilling lives. Okay, then let's uh, solve the questions they have in your book on page 107. I want from you to read more about uh, Down syndrome. Uh, these people are normal people, but Yani, you're talking about only one chromosome that caused this problem with them, okay? Uh, let's talk about the questions they are in your uh, book. Uh, these are questions down, okay? What type of error in meiosis causes Down syndrome? What type of error? A chromatid of a chromosome, again, uh, we said a 21 do not separate. So a six cell gets two copies of a chromosome 21 instead of one. Uh, instead, instead of one, okay? So when the six cell joins a normal six cell, the zygote has three copies of chromosome 21 instead of two. I'm going to show you the answers, but let's talk about the uh, question 14. Uh, research the characteristics of Down syndrome. How can some of difficulties caused by disorder uh, be uh, overcome? How do you think so?
uh, you have to recognize uh, that the symptoms of Down syndrome uh, vary and that some people have a greater success than others uh, overcoming the difficulties of the uh, disease. Uh, you want to study uh, special uh, therapies, uh, learning programs, and uh, mini uh, uh, streaming. Actually, this is a question I'm going to ask you to, to make a research about it, and it's required from you. It has, I'm going to give like five points of it. It's, uh, it's not optional. Five points from your third assessment, it's gonna be on this research. Okay, five points from your assessment, all of it. If you don't give it, I'll put zero of this uh, for, uh, this assessment and this assessment. Okay, that. let's continue now. Uh, you have also here recommend uh, research that a special Olympics uh, then uh, make an informative uh, brochure. Um, because we are not uh, at school now, we can. If we are in the school, we can do it. But um, I'll stop here. I'll show you now the answer of question thirteen. For question fourteen, you have to make a research about it. Uh, I'm going to show you now question fourteen, thirteen. Copy the answer. Here you go. Sorry for this. Copy the answer for question 13. And now I'm going to show you another uh, questions. I want to discuss with you other questions. Uh, I want to thank you uh, to th you to think what happens to cells and the chromosomes during meiosis? What happened to the cells and the chromosomes? You have to know the DNA in the chromosome uh, is copied and the cell goes through two division. The DNA is divided twice, resulting in four cells, each having half as much DNA as original uh, cell. Uh, in meiosis 1, each pair of homologous split up. Uh, in meiosis 2, the two copies of each homologue uh, separate. This results in four cells with a single set of homologs. Okay, uh, I want to ask another question. Describe the cells that are produced uh, following mitosis uh, meiosis. Uh, for mitosis, form two diploid cells that are genetically identical to parent. Uh, meiosis produce four haploid cells that each have just one chromosome from each homologous chromosomes uh, pair. Okay, I'm going to show you now these questions with their answers I want you to copy these answers So this is for the first one. For the second one, this is the second question. If you still have questions about uh, the meiosis, mitosis, about the phases, about the Down syndrome, you can send me your questions. Uh, now, thank you for uh, listening.